hello and welcome to our channel mockup art today we have a paint bucket mockup if you want this mockup link can be found in the description so let's get started now first click on the paint tool and select the area for selection purpose Now there will be a lot of part to selection so we are going to fast forward the time a little bit if you want we can create separate selection video comment us in below So most of <coughs> so most of all parts are selected. Now select them all and create a folder. It will be help to organize your file. Okay. Now use the rectangle tool and create a rectangle along with the paint bucket. Just make it a little larger so you can wrap it around very closely. Just a little bit. Okay. Now change its color whichever you would like. Right click and create with a smart object. Now use Ctrl T to transform it and wrap it. Right click then wrap. Then choose the wrap mode to arc. Down the arc. Press Ctrl key and reduce it the wrapping size. Make it as much close as possible with the paint bucket wrapping. That point is the main point to change the wrapping position. You can increase or decrease this size with using the Ctrl T shortcut. Now wrapping is done. Ctrl plus click on the main selection, then mask out with the smart object. Use the paint tool again and create this shape. Just 
just edit it a little bit along with the wrapping curve it's for mark it's for only masking purpose so try to make it as precisely as possible now select the mask select the background color to black use the brush tool and remove it Ctrl plus click the whole layer and create a solid color layer. It will be our base color for the bucket. Now create the click on the background layer. And check those areas where the color is leakaging. We have to delete them manually. Now remove the metal portion. Use the selection tool and create multiple points. You don't have to be precise, you can grow around it. Click on the mask, select the background layer to white and foreground layer to black and place Alt Backspace. Do same thing for other part, first select them. You can use the paint tool here too if you want. Just go all around it. Make the point together. Click on the mask and place Alt Black Space. Now the smart object is ready, the background color is ready. Click on the smart object and place any design you want. It's totally up to you whatever design you want to create. Now the smart object has been created, sorry the overlay color has been created. So copy the main image and create three copy of it. It will be our lighting.
name the lower first one letter layer to shadow the upper one to mid tone and the topmost one to light turn both of them off make the first one to liner burn the second one to liner dodge add you have to change the levels for this one this is our midtone layer so dial up this properties as the way you want just try to make it as realistic as possible just a little bit now for the light layer make it to screen you have to change the level for these two don't overdo it sometimes you may reduce the opacity too for a better realistic shadow and lighting now create a background solid color layer and make it a liner burn now most of parts is done our mock up is ready Thank you for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe for future updates